Hello, welcome to the channel, subscribe and leave a like. In today's video we are going to talk about microwaves. The difference between food made in the microwave or using other methods is in the way the food is cooked. In the conventional way, the heat is initially higher on the outside of the food, causing it to be cooked from the outside in. In the case of a microwave, the device heats the water molecules in the dish, cooking from the inside out. In this way, what will influence the result of the taste, color and texture of the food is the water content it has. The larger the amount, the closer the flavor will be between different methods. Similarly, if you put in a food with a low liquid content, water will vaporize during cooking, making your meal dry and bland. What happens to food made in the microwave? When we put food in the microwave, it is heated or cooked using a form of non-ionizing electromagnetic radiation, known as a microwave, hence the name of the device. They are emitted by a device located inside the oven, an electronic tube called a magnetron. When they come into contact with food, they are absorbed by the water molecules present in it, which begin to vibrate quickly, accumulating thermal energy, resulting in its heating. In short, we can say that it is the water in your food placed in the microwave oven that is being heated. It is important to make it clear that using the equipment does not bring about chemical changes in the molecules of the products. Upon absorbing energy, the ions in the food polarize and rotate, resulting in mini collisions. It is a sequence of these mini collisions that generate heat through friction. When the device is turned off, all the existing energy field disappears causing the water molecules that were previously in motion to stop changing polarity. So rest assured, the only change in the food is that, after being in the microwave, it is hot. End of friction, just eat. Do microwaved foods lose nutritional value? No, foods heated in microwave ovens do not lose nutrients beyond normal. All cooked food has nutrients broken down, regardless of the method. In fact, it is believed that a microwave can help this reduction in nutritional value to be less than on the stove, for example. According to Harvard Health, a journal of the Harvard University School of Medicine, the less time foods are cooked, the less nutritional loss. A study was conducted by the university in 2009, comparing the amount of substances in dishes made in different cooking methods. Among those that resulted in the lowest nutrient and antioxidant lows were microwave cooking alongside roasting and grilling. In fact, using this household appliance can reduce the amount of bacteria in food, resulting in a pasteurization method and food safety. The tip is to always keep an eye on the type of food you want to cook and the time. Too many minutes can result in dishes with an undesirable texture, rubbery meats, loss of texture in dry foods. Until the next video.